finally forgot about the nightmarish Olympics and now pleases the audience with gorgeous performances. How we missed her. The competitive season has come to an end for the skaters, but this does not mean that the audience will no longer see their favorite athletes on the ice. Many of them continue to delight fans with performances in the show. So, the best representatives of the Russian national team gathered at the Megasport Ice Palace as part of the gala evening lovers of figure skating, and the current Olympic champion Anna Shcherbakova headed the Galaxy of Stars. Student to Terry Tutbirds delighted the fans with her versatility and dedication. It's definitely not easy to compete with her in popularity. But Camila Voliva succeeded. The figure skater finally forgot the nightmarish Olympics in Beijing and appeared stronger and more confident. Her skating takes your breath away and tears of happiness flow. How we miss just such a Camila. This weekend, not only experienced athletes went on the ice, but also very young stars. Sofia Samadolkina had the honor to open the rentals. A student of Sergei Davidov showed a modernized program for the blizzard of Georgi Sviridov, completely captivating the hall. Together with her, Adelia Petrosyan was a success with fans. The ward of Terry Tutbird swiftly swept through the rink, striking the imagination with complex jumps. It is obvious that the younger generation is ready to push adult colleagues in the shop here as well. Nevertheless, the skill developed over the years and the theatrical past in the show has a lot of weight. Alexei Yagudin proved this by his example, who, along with Olympic champions Tatyana Tatmyanina and Maxim Marinin, demonstrated how to organize a real holiday. Bright racing and touching oblivion, Alexei looks great in any role, causing the audience goosebumps of admiration with his signature footsteps and rotations. I have only one question all day. What are three people doing at this holiday of mischief, grace, youth, Tatyana Tatmyanina, Maxim Marinin and Alexei Yagudin? And so, the mood is great, the Olympic champion jokingly commented on his performance in the mixed zone, noting that such an old sick man like him is happy just to communicate with figure skaters, being in the same arena with them. No matter what Mr. Yagudin says, but he is slightly deceiving, his amazing rentals have shown that there is still gunpowder in the powder flasks. The same could be said about charming ladies. Evgenia Medvedeva and Elizabeta Tiktamasheva lit up in Moscow, showing their best numbers. The two-time world champion came out with the legendary program Memoirs of a Geisha, opening it with the purest triple salkow. Zhenya's spectacular skating is not to be confused with anything, smooth, neat, but at the same time powerful, it made people's hearts freeze. Unfortunately, Medvedeva did not go out on the ice anymore, the girl changed her skates for heels and went to host a show, commenting on the performances of other participants. The figure skater spoke especially warmly about her friend Elizaveta Tiktamasheva. The empress gave her all 100%. This evening the audience saw several triple axles from her in two programs at once. Lisa brilliantly coped with the technical part even in difficult conditions with dim lighting, but then something happened that no one expected. The athlete could not stay on her feet and fell out of the blue. A funny mistake did not blur the impression of her rental but caused a puzzled smile on the faces of the audience. It seems that the example of Mark Kondratyuk, who also tore off the path of steps at the Channel One Cup, is contagious. The pupil of CSKA this time was almost flawless. Yes, there was a butterfly on the quad jump, but it was the fourth quad in a row from Mark. The European champion did not feel sorry for himself and went to several Ultra C in two programs in the dark. First, the athlete showed his Swan Lake, which became his calling card, and seasoned it with two quadruple salches, made so easily, as if it cost him nothing, and then performed an authentic cradles program, in which he also tried to make a couple of quads. For the end of the season, Mark is in great shape, while he shows a real fighting character, not shirking from work even on the show. Undoubtedly, Kondratyuk, like no one else, deserves to become the new leader of our male singles. Evgeny Semenenko is also working hard, who is not only running his new short program with a quadruple jump, but also experimenting with form and serve. Artistically, Alexei Mishin's student is growing by leaps and bounds. A new dance number in a spacesuit is a clear challenge for a figure skater, 
but Zhenya successfully coped with this test, earning loud applause from a grateful audience. Everyone was looking forward to the appearance of a new Olympic champion. Anna Cherbakova did not disappoint and twice drove fans into a frenzy with her rentals. A graceful lady of the storm or a gentle angel, Anya masterfully juggles stage masks, but one thing remains unchanged, her incredibly emotional and high-quality skating. It is not surprising that the audience did not want to let Cherbakova go for a long time, throwing toys at her and shouting pleasant wishes. Perhaps only one athlete could compete with Anya in popularity on this day. Camila Valiva's participation in the show was a real surprise for the audience. 15-year-old student Terry Tutbirds made a gift to everyone by showing last year's short program Storm. The figure skater came out in a new blue and white dress and looked simply gorgeous in it, but her performance was even better. From the very first notes, Camila caught some kind of magical mood, riveting all eyes to herself. Soft, sensual, brilliant, a number of epithets can be continued indefinitely. Goosebumps ran through the body after each perfectly executed element. The sportswoman of the crystal was clearly on a roll, for the first time since the Olympics, Boliva looked so liberated and happy. After the end of the rental, the stands stood, barely holding back tears. How we miss just such a Camila.